It says it turns nights into mornings and the friends we now call familia. Let's see what it tastes like. It tastes like mango. You see, Monster don't never let me down. I don't got nothing negative to say about Monster. I've been living on Monster for a long time. It's called Ultimate Fiesta. Ultra Fiesta. 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 It's John, all right, man. It tastes like a, a mango fiesta. Like, is you ever had a fiesta with mangoes? That's what this is. But for real, I'm waiting on my mama's cooking cup. I, cup. I ordered a mama's cooking cup from uh, Kwame Brown because, you know, that's my man. You know, that nigga been, he been showing y'all punk motherfuckers the real from the fake. And I feel like he been part in the Red Sea, meaning you can tell the niggas that's fake by the ones who... Oh, I can't believe he said that. The offended motherfuckers versus the niggas that's like, yeah, I'm glad somebody said it. Kwame Brown is ending you motherfuckers' careers, ending you motherfuckers' bullshit charade, calling out punk-ass Matt Bonds, beating up girls and shit, beating up women, all the time calling them out. You know what I'm saying? Like, I'm glad, man. All he asked for was an apology. And that's DC Washington Bullets, Wizards fans. We Kwame Brown may not know, but we always had that niggas back. We knew they ain't let him play. We knew he could ball. Nigga lasted 12 years in the NBA. You mean tell me that's a bust? How is that? You tell me how that's a bust. How is that a bust? So anyway, Kwame Brown, that's my dude. When I get my bus life, uh, Kwame Brown bus life cup, I'm going to do a video with it. And I'm going to keep on defending him, watching his videos, watching him call out these fake ass niggas that really hate women, that pretend like they love women, calling women names, calling them all kinds of Treating him in the old kind of way. Matt Bonds beating up his ex-girlfriends, ex-wives, trying to own him. Matt Bonds, one of the niggas that, 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 that you know, get a, got a wife, got a woman. She move on with her life and he want to keep her under his thumb. Little punk motherfucker. I don't like motherfuckers like that. See, Matt Bonds, one of them niggas is why I don't hang around other mixed people. Because he make people like me look bad. He from California somewhere talking all proper and all that shit. Fuck that shit. Kwame Brown is Geechee. Geechee. You fuck with him if you want to. I be wondering, is my great grandma Geechee? She from South Carolina. Well, her great her parents was. She's dark as a mug too. Know what I'm saying? My folks keep fucking with Kwame Brown if you want to. Kwame Brown, we is on your side. We got your back. These real punk, these real niggas need to start showing these fake niggas what's up. Because I'm tired of these fake motherfuckers controlling the narrative, thinking they can talk any old kind of way about any old body. When you do something, you know, they can't do, they want to judge you for it. Oh, he, he, he didn't do it like this. Same thing with Floyd. Talking about Floyd, they just jealous because niggas making money. Oh, guess what else? Talk about Stephen A. Smith and the go-along, get-along gang. I saw Stephen A. Smith was on All the Smoke about a year ago. So you mean to tell me none of that shit is connected? Come on now. Kwame Brown, keep exposing these little punk-ass bitches. Keep it going because we down for you. All the real motherfuckers, all the real men that know how to treat women, that got mamas, that taught them stuff, or elders that taught them stuff, grandmamas, mamas, daddies, granddaddies, whatever. We know what mama's cooking is. I might be from D.C. area, but fucking I know what mama's cooking is. And guess what? You can tell the niggas that ain't got no mama's cooking because these motherfuckers running around like chickens with their head cut off. Like you said, happy to take pictures with other niggas and pose with other motherfuckers and get some kind of fake ass clout based on who they with. They can't stand on their own two feet. The one thing that people can't stand is they feel intimidated when a man don't need nobody else to validate himself. Kwame Brown, keep it up. I got show support. I'm getting my uh, mama's cooking cup in the mail soon. And I'm going to post a video for it. And God damn it, every day I look forward to your videos so you can drop some gems. I look, at, I look for your videos like I look for church sermons. Keep it up, my man. Keep it up.